Right, Dorky Warren just come away 3 0 winners today. It's going to be a funny question, people might think, but were you happy with the with the performance and, and, and the game today? Yeah, it was actually, to be fair, because I think Chip and Amar are a really good side, and I think they've got a huge amount of legs in the side, lots of young pros there on loan. They're well built in the right areas. They're, they're one of those deceptive teams, and that's why they're knocking on the door of the playoffs. And yeah, we are fortunate we got three goals to the good, I thought, in terms of um, by half time. It meant the game was relatively done. I thought it showed we hadn't played for two weeks. I thought we gassed a little bit. They're a team that make you work hard. And I, and I said before the game, Gary, to you even, that they'll still be in the 95th minute running about, and they were. Mm. I thought our units weren't amazing. Um, I thought Fogden and Josh had to cover a lot of ground because yeah. we were a little bit detached. I thought could have been a bit sharper, pushing out of the back and closing down space. Mm. But 3-0, goals matter in this division, mm. in this um, in this next few weeks, goals are going to matter. So we're really pleased we're getting three, a three goal advantage today. And we got Jason out there for 60 minutes. We There was a, a few boys rested today that will go fresh on Monday. That would be a, a big deal for us, which is great for us. And um, yeah, so second arc could have been better, yeah, for sure. Um, but I thought we just gassed a little bit. We probably made a mistake. We didn't train Saturday last week or last night, which we were going to do. Okay. So we only had one training session. Oh, right. So I thought it showed a little bit mentally, physically, a little mm. bit, um, a little bit. But that's okay. We, we went down the sort of fresh route and hopefully that would bode well for Monday. Today would have, you know, been a real sharpener for them and it'd be a tough game on Monday. Well, they had a few shots, to be fair, chipping them. If, they were, if their shots were on targets, they could have caused us a few little problems, couldn't yeah, they? Yeah, I think they're a good side. I, I, to be honest, I do think we played the scoreline there a little bit. I yeah. think we was in no hurry. Mm -hmm. The back three weren't really trying to play out like we normally would. It was, uh, you know, they, they sort of protected themselves a bit. They sat in, they were tired. Um, having not played, I think they were tired. But, you know, I think credit to chipping them because um, they, they do put you in a game. Mm and we just scored good goals at the right time and all in the first half. So it was kind of game done, really. Good goals by McShane. Good to see him sniffing in, in that 18 or well, in the six-yard box, mainly. And he's got two goals by him. Yeah, he's just one of our stalwart players, isn't he? Do you know what I mean? He's one of our boys and, you know, he never lets us down. You know what I feel like? I feel like if that game had been nil-nil, I feel like we'd, we'd have won the second half 2-0. You know, I, I feel like we played the scoreline a little bit. We gave ourselves a... Um, a concession really for being three up. I thought that's how we played the match. But I've got to say, all over the park, they were sharp and fit. I thought it showed that we hadn't really played in a few weeks. Yeah, true, no, I do agree. A uh, couple of pointers, penalties, cut the penalties, you feel? Yeah. I don't know why Fogden, he, he, well, why did he go down when he could have shot? He, you know what I mean, we must have been he, taken he, out. He was about to get wiped out, so I think he anticipated it. Um, if he stays on his feet, he gets wiped out. Ref thinks he went down easy, but Listen, um, that's, it, didn't, it didn't impact the game today, so we're fully focused, guys, on Monday. Monday's a you know, really important game away from home against a team that's fighting for their lives, so we've got to be really switched on for that. And a uh, couple of issues, uh, Phil Pot and Nar McManus, anything? Uh, what's, what's the issue I with thought, them two? I thought Nar was weirdly tired, so I just made that change. Um, not so sure I'd make that change if I had the chance again. Um, and Isaac took a Jason's elbow. Oh, did he? Yeah, and he, he had a head of a shine. Oh, what, in the 18 yard box? Yeah, 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 yeah. So hopefully there's no concussion and stuff like that. Oh, um, okay. Yeah, then he'll be fine. But got a lot to choose, a lot of boys to choose from for Monday. We'll have to get that right, and it's going to be, hopefully, our supporters will come. So there's a real short journey to Welling, it's 40 minutes max, especially on the bank on Monday. So we want to, you know, they need to be right behind us. and. Monday's going to be a, an interesting day for the league, isn't it? 100%. They were 3-0 down today, Willing, and they come back to 3 all at Eastbourne Borough. I'd imagine their changing room would be, would be buzzing, so they'll be taking that into Monday. And, you know, we've got the Kent derby, and, you know, it's, it's just it's great, isn't it? It's great for the league, the competition. I think those two guys, Dartford and Maidstone, have had one eye on that game for a long time. Wish I could go and watch it. It'd be such a great game and two good teams, two good managers, you know. Um, but we've just got to take care of our business. Definitely. Wedding is going to be a tricky place to go. The pitch is not in great shape. So we've just got to make sure we get tactics right. Might change, I think, to be honest. Probably change what we do on Monday. Um, and um, 
and, and take, try and take care of business. Sure, well, well done today. Three points, Cheers, three mate. goals, clean sheet, and uh, good news. On we go. On Cheers, upwards. Cheers, buddy.